A local high school is welcoming students back today for the first day of school. Fox 5's Eric Richards is in Poway with the measures being taken to keep students and staff members safe. Yeah, I can tell you today was the first day of school here at Abraxas High School in Poway and I actually spoke with a mom when she was bringing her son as they were walking up and she says her son only has seven students in his classroom. Of course, these new safety measures now in effect. Now I can tell you Abraxas High is a year round continuation school with about 231 students who usually need more of one on one or in person attention. And today does mark the start of the transition program here, which has about 96 students, but not all will be on campus. Now, if parents choose to send their kids to school, they will be split up into two groups with alternating schedules to ensure that social distancing. Students will have on campus learning two days a week and three days of distance learning. Teachers and staff, well, they'll also be required to wear face coverings. School officials say students and their families are asked to self screen for COVID-19 at home and then check temperatures before coming to campus. Now we spoke with a parent along with her son who is part of that transition program designed to promote greater independence and life skills for those with developmental disabilities ages 18 to 22. I am excited about this program. This program has sent us three pages worth of uh, precautions that they are taking. Uh, we've got his classroom will only have seven students in it maximum. Um, social distancing and sanitation and all of that has made me feel very confident about it. So you're comfortable? So I'm comfortable with it. Or I wouldn't be here. Yes, I'm comfortable with it. So. I'm kind of intrigued. Uh, you're intrigued about today? Yeah. It's going to be fun, huh? You don't even know what to expect, huh, buddy? It will be fun. A lot of changes. Yeah. <laughs> right, well, good luck to you, Joshua. Thank you. And the remainder of schools right here in the Poway Unified School District, we're told, will resume on August 19th. Here in Poway, Eric Richards, Fox 5 News. Eric, appreciate that. For its other schools, the Poway Unified District, along with the Escondido Union and San Diego Union School Districts, are developing plans to split students between in-person and remote learning. In East County, Cajon Valley Union School District reopened this week for in-person teaching. San Diego Unified and Chula Vista Elementary Districts will begin the school year with online learning only. Most other local school districts have yet to announce their official back-to-school plans, and tomorrow, Governor Gavin Newsom is expected to release his guidelines for reopening campuses.